12 Weird Wonders of Nature. Number 12. Spiderweb trees. Pakistan was hit by major flooding in 2010, which killed nearly 2,000 people. To escape the rising waters, thousands of spiders took to the trees and pretty much took them over, wrapping them up in cocoons and connecting the trees with the silk. An unexpected benefit turned out to be a drop in the local mosquito population, despite so much stagnant standing water. It's thought the mosquitoes were trapped by the spiders' webs, and that lessened the threat of malaria. Number 11. Lake Handy. The unusual lake in Kazakhstan was created by way of an earthquake in 1911, which triggered a massive limestone landslide that resulted in submerged, dried out tree trunks rising above the surface. The one time forest was transformed into a lake, and quite a unique one at that. Number 10. Ice clouds. Earlier in 2016, scorching temperatures in Queensland, Australia, and rare geographic conditions created a formula for some incredible sights in the sky. Heavy thunderstorms and thick clouds combined with ice particles lingering in the atmosphere to create ice clouds, and that yielded some spectacular pictures taken by locals and posted to social media outlets. The vibrant color schemes would be worthy of an artist, or at least a Photoshop expert. Number 9. Cosmic Sculptures. We'll go off-planet for this one. After all, nature's phenomena isn't just confined to Earth, right? This image was released in 2010 and was captured by the Hubble's Advanced Camera for Surveys. It shows radiation carving away at molecular clouds of dust and ice in the Carina Nebula, an estimated 7,500 light years away. Some of us thought the image looked similar to a burned marshmallow. What did you see? Number 8. Mima Mounds. Now this is a phenomenon that is found in the prairies close to Olympia, Washington State. And no, it's not some form of bubble wrap. This photo from the Washington State Department of Natural Resources displays a series of oval dome-like natural mounds. They range in size from more than 50 meters in diameter to over 2 meters in height. They're found at the Mima Mounds Natural Area Preserve. So how were the mounds formed? That has been a huge question since their discovery in 1841. At first, they were thought to be ancient Indian graveyards, but when excavated, the mounds contained no evidence of human remains. Some theories for the origin include the burrowing of gophers to being the result of ground shaking from major earthquakes. Number seven. Pamukkale. Did you know this is the most popular attraction in Turkey? Known as the Cotton Castle, it's located in the southwest part of the country, and the brilliant white landscape, which appears like terraces and pools, is the result of mineral deposits in thermal waters that are thought to have healing effects. Those minerals hardened over time to form those unique shapes. Visitors have been coming to the area for over 2,000 years, and from the scenery, including spectacular sunsets, it is certainly easy to understand the attraction. The Cotton Castle is visible from over 10 miles away. Number six. Sailing stones. Here's a phenomenon that has occurred in various locations around the world, but most notably at Racetrack Playa in California's Death Valley National Park. Huge rocks, some weighing up to 700 pounds, seem to move all by themselves, with no apparent intervention from humans or animals, often leaving trails over 300 feet long. Some trails are curved while others travel in a straight line, then abruptly shift to the right or left. So what's behind the mystery? Some theories suggest the big stones move as a result of water and ice forming in Death Valley under certain winter conditions. A breeze could then float the rocks across the muddy bottom of the valley floor, leaving trails in the mud as the stones moved. Research conducted in 2015 suggested that sailing stones found in Spain's Manchego Lagoon moved as a result of microbacteria living on the lagoon's floor. The microorganisms created slippery conditions, allowing the stones to move during the rainy season when wind and water currents were at the strongest, but no theory has been definitively proven. Number 5. Cave of the Crystals 
It's located almost 1,000 feet below the surface in Nica, Chihuahua, Mexico, and is known to hold some of the largest natural crystals ever found. While they look icy, the mass of crystals are forged in temperatures up to 122 degrees Fahrenheit and were developed over 500,000 years in mineral-rich water, and they can measure up to 4 feet wide and 50 feet long. These hidden caves were drained over 40 years ago, but the crystals made of gypsum were unearthed by miners in 2000. Because temperatures in the caves can reach 136 degrees Fahrenheit and humidity reaching levels of nearly 100 percent, they're largely unexplored. Researchers can only enter for short periods, and in order to preserve the crystals, there are plans to reflood the cave. Number 4. Batara Gorge Waterfall. In northern Lebanon, you can find a very unique three-tiered waterfall where water crashes some 850 feet through cavernous gorges and circular rock formations. It's an actual triple waterfall. The water plummets into a cave formed out of Jurassic area limestone called the Batara Pothole. Inside the cliffs is a labyrinth of tunnels lit only by occasional patches of sunlight. The cave is also called the Cave of the Three Bridges due to the natural bridges that overhang a fissure that descends into Mount Lebanon. The waterfall and cavern is considered one of the wonders of Lebanon and we are inclined to agree. Number 3. Balancing Act. Your eyes do not deceive you. Those are goats that actually climbed a 17-foot tree in Morocco. How did this come to be? Well, these animals, anyway, seem to be accomplished at climbing trees, and they jump and claw their way up the branches, searching for the tree's olive-like berries, which the goats will go to any heights to reach, apparently. Of course, goats are known for their ability to scale steep, sheer surfaces. In fact, some of their relatives, the alpine ibex, scaled the sheer side of Italy's Cigino Dam in 2011 as they tried to feed on salt leaking from between the stones. But goats climbing sheer surfaces, okay, that does seem to be a a weird wonder of nature that happens fairly regularly, but goats climbing trees, now that seems pretty unique. Number two. I see you. It almost looks like a Photoshop effort, but this is a natural phenomenon, and it's located on Sackland Island in East Russia. From high above, you can make out the pupil in the center of the volcano, which is surrounded by a brown iris. Mud volcanoes are caused by a buildup of gases and liquids. With pressure built up, mud is released through fractures in the volcano structure, and that can create bizarre patterns, as you can see. Number 1. Caño Cristales. It's located in Colombia and is commonly called the River of Five Colors or the Liquid Rainbow. Due to its striking colors, it's often referred to as the world's most beautiful river. You can detect green, yellow, blue, black, and red in particular, but only during half the year. That's because of a native aquatic plant called Macarinia clavidra. The plant is what gives the river its distinctive coloration, but it's only active between June to December. The river is closed the rest of the year to give the local ecology a break. Do you think it looks like a liquid rainbow? Well, we thought it looks like a river of Skittles.